So they're just vast and marvelous and majestic spectrums in which we can raise our consciousness. Vast spectrums of consciousness out there available to us to raise our awareness to. And every day I'm just surprised at how much better it gets <clears throat> and how much more how much higher I can raise my consciousness and how much more power is in that raised consciousness, how much love there actually is in the infinite mind, how much God actually has for us. And oh, it's just a, it's just a, such a, a joy every day to get up and uh, get out early and uh, get out in the fresh air and begin to run uh, and run two miles every morning like I do and get full of energy and then come back here and meditate uh, upon these marvelous truths uh, and realize how great they are and realize how vast is this universe and realize how many creation, how much creative ability I actually have when I raise my consciousness and have, have realize how much we can actually do for the world and realize how, how many things, uh, how many different types of energy and powers and strains can pour over us as we begin to raise that consciousness to all those vast spectrums that are available to us. A vast spectrum of love, a vast spectrum of joy, a vast spectrum of peace, a vast spectrum of healing power, and we can raise our uh, awareness to all those things and as we get into that spectrum of healing power we can uh, truly heal any disease uh, and help anybody uh, raise anybody up out of any kind of problem and it can it's it's a powerful enough to to lift you out of difficulty <coughs> it's powerful enough to lift you out of your limitations it's powerful enough to put you on the ground of abundance it's powerful enough uh to uh raise you out of cancer it's powerful enough to raise you out of diabetes it's powerful enough to raise you out of lupus it's powerful enough to to raise you out of any form of heart disease it's powerful enough to to raise you out of any uh sickness or illness or disease whatsoever and we can raise our consciousness to the point where we can re begin to receive that power uh, to such an extent that it flows out of us, that it begins to flow out of us uh, uh, like living water and washes across uh, uh, everybody that co we come in contact with and uh, begins to uh, have a, a create an, uh, a, uh, a uh, powerful, strong uh, uh, ability to change uh, things uh, uh, and harmonize things and, and bring things into perfection and bring things into order. And so uh, it's just uh, a, a wonderful day today uh, uh, to begin to uh, uh, meditate upon these things and uh, and uh, begin to listen to shows like uh, this Tanya Love program, which I'm going to listen to in a few minutes. Uh, this morning she's talking about uh, ascension symptoms uh, and uh, things we need to be aware of as we begin to uh, ascend in consciousness and uh, begin to raise our awareness and uh, the things which we uh, encounter in that and and uh, she's a marvelous teacher and uh, has uh, so many uh, good ideas and uh, and so much receives so much uh, information and and uh, understanding uh, uh, and, and her meditations in her prayer room and all and her angel room and then she puts them out on this uh these channels and i listen to them every morning for breakfast i listen to her her uh uh show and it just uh raises me up in consciousness and uh causes me to uh uh ascend in exhilaration and joy more and more every day and so uh, i'm going to uh, uh get that uh, going here uh, uh pretty soon <laughs> and uh and uh and just see what she has for me this time. You know, I, like I say, I always, uh, I always uh, get the feeling so uh, uh, exhilarated and energetic uh, uh, after I uh, I get out and uh, they make my uh, morning run and uh, and get my uh, blood circulation going and uh, and get my mind to working good and and then I I get to, and then I come back and get into my meditations. I get the feeling so uh, I, like I have ascended so high and that I'm raised so much in consciousness and there's so much joy flooding over me and so much love and, and so much peace uh, and so much healing uh, and uh, I feel just every cell of my body just full of radiant health and I feel it just pouring out everywhere. I feel it like, like it's just rushing out into the world uh, that it's beginning to heal people and I know I'll hear about testimonies of people that have been healed. Oh yes and, uh, and how they uh, uh, any time uh, we should understand it. Any time we raise our consciousness, uh, even a little bit, 
it's going to affect things around us. And uh, by our uh, by our uh, uh, being willing to raise our consciousness like that, uh, we're affecting change in the world. Every time we raise our consciousness into a little bit more healing power, there's people somewhere in the world uh, that, that it becomes easier for them to receive their healing. And uh, people in the, uh, somewhere in the world are being healed of their uh, diseases and their difficulties if we begin to, as we begin to raise our consciousness. And so it's imperative and it's a, uh, uh, behooves us to, to every day uh, to to begin to raise that consciousness. You know, our uh, our thought, uh, this has been said before, uh, doesn't originate with me, but it's been said before that uh, just the, the uh, uh, just uh, spending a minute or two on a high, exalted uh, spiritual thought is enough sometimes to heal inveterate diseases. It's sometimes enough just to heal a uh, uh, to heal somebody in the world will re- will he- receive healing of a, a terminal illness uh, just by us spending a uh, a few minutes in a high and exalted uh, enough uh, uh, thinking about. Uh, healing power and how vast the healing power of God is and how many oceans of healing there are out there that are ready to pour in upon us and how many uh, how many Niagara's of healing power are, are actually within us now uh, waiting for us to become conscious of and how close God is to us how omnipotent God is all these thoughts you going letting all these thoughts going into uh, going through your mind how we are actually coexistent with God and God is a, a, a our infinite mind source uh, that we're coexistent with uh, is only waiting for us to uh, become aware of that coexistence. He's only uh, waiting for us to become aware that his healing power is present. It's all present, but he's wa- he's only waiting for us to become aware of his uh, omnipotence and his uh, omnipower power, and that in him we live and move and have our being, Acts 17, 28. And he's only waiting for us to become aware uh, that if we come to the truth of, uh, and the knowledge and awareness of all these things and how one we are with source and how uh, and how uh, uh, coexistent uh, forever and immortal and how actual, actually immortal we are and how actual powerful we really are uh, to, to affect change and how powerful we are to affect healing. Uh, getting our minds on all these things, uh, as we begin to do that, it can affect uh, it can actually already begin to affect uh, all kinds of change, which we'll never may never even become aware of, but which is uh, being affected in this world and in this universe. And so let us uh, take the responsibility to do that and become aware of all of this. Uh, and uh, and uh, it's uh, it's our uh, our uh, as I say, uh, uh, waiting. Uh, infinite mind is only waiting for us to become. The reason why, you see, I'm saying this because people will be asking, well, why do I do not do I not have uh, healing already? If uh, infinite mind, uh, uh, God is uh, so uh, present, if the source is already present with me, and it's because he's only waiting for you to raise your awareness to what is there. You're already immortal, and you're already one with infinite mind. You're already one with source, and you will be immortal. Uh, you will continue to be immortal. Uh, however, uh, it doesn't benefit your body. The physical outward form of your body is not benefited until you become conscious of that oneness and you become conscious of that immortality. So it's necessary not just for uh, the fact to be uh, uh, for it to be a fact. It's not necessary uh, just necessary for. Uh, the, the, uh, it to be a fact that we are immortal and for it to be a fact which is is for us to be coexistent and for a fact for us to, to be uh, uh, one with sorts and one for the infinite mind God uh, but it's also necessary for us to raise our awareness to, to the uh, fact that that is true and so uh, I'm going to uh, see if uh, uh, Tanya Love can raise that awareness a little bit more this morning while I uh, Get this uh, wonderful coffee out here and uh, have my uh, marvelous breakfast this morning. <laughs> and uh, I've got it fixed just exactly right. And it's all in order uh, this morning and it's all uh, ready to go. <laughs> and uh, and uh, I just enjoy all of that, having everything, uh, having the eggs fixed just exactly right. And uh, the toast fixed just exactly right. The pancakes toasted just exactly right. Everything in order. And then putting on a nice uh, uh, program like this where uh, uh, this a uh, uh, Tanya Love uh, has uh, such marvelous thoughts, to, and they're all uh, in order and come out uh, uh, nice and and uh, enjoyable to hear. And uh, 
and just it just makes for a nice breakfast uh, uh, to be able to just kind of go along and listen to her and, uh, and then eat along on my food and, and drink this marvelous coffee. This morning, uh, I've got so many good flavors. Uh, it's I've got um, a Cafe Supreme, which is a wonderful uh, malted, sort of like a malted flavor, uh, smooth tasting coffee, which I, I usually have sometime uh, uh, mid morning or afternoon. It, it's just a marvelous coffee. Uh, uh, they got the right name on it when they when they called it Supreme, and um, it's a uh, this uh, I've got this also uh, this uh, chocolate. Uh, which is called Cafe Mocha, and it has just but it has just the right amount of chocolate mixed in with the coffee, and uh, brings out the flavor of the coffee, and it also it's kind of like, gets you kind of a, uh, a mood, kind of like a hot chocolate, like you'd have when you drink hot chocolate and all, but you also have the coffee there, the, the good nice coffee, wonderful coffee taste, and and uh, then I have uh, this uh, Cafe uh, Latte. Which is, uh, oh yeah, I mean, it just, uh, you know how it, uh, the uh, latte tastes at Starbucks, but this is a whole lot better than that. And it, you know, it tastes just like you got ice cream and coffee mixed together, uh, <laughs> and all in your cup, and uh, uh, and uh, just a co uh, coffee, uh, coffee a la mode, as it, as it were. <laughs> and uh, so uh, it's just, a, it's a marvelous uh, thing for us to, uh, for me to, uh, that I really enjoy. It comes in these uh, nice little little packages like this that you just pour in your cup and add water and uh oh it's a it's a it's a it's a wonderful thing the way they package this up and make it so convenient and i so enjoy it and uh and then of course i got the uh <coughs> the coffee uh the black coffee which is uh uh has the name of coffee noir and uh it uh it comes in just little these little small uh, packages like this, uh, which uh, they're, they're they're really compact because it's just black coffee. You know, it doesn't have like doesn't have cream and sugar and all that in it, and so it's very compact. And if you like black coffee, well, I mean that's just uh, really marvelous because you can pick fit three or four of these things into your shirt pocket just like that. You know, and and just keep them with you all the time. You know, and then you can put these larger pockets in your suit coat. Uh, these larger packages, but you can keep that right there, and it's always with you. You know, I mean, all you got to do is just just grab your styrofoam cup of uh, somewhere, you know, wherever you're at on your rounds or uh, going uh, uh, visitations or whatever you're, you're doing, and just grab a cup, you know, and uh, put it in the microwave with hot water, and then you got your just dump it right in there, and you're all you're ready to go with that. And so, uh, but I've got also this uh, Columbia roast, which is. It's a marvelous tasting coffee. It's just I, I you know I can't believe how how uh, how fresh and how uh, much of a brewed fresh freshly brewed just like you know just like the you know uh, the freshest cup of coffee that you've ever tasted just straight out of the uh, the coffee pot. But when it's just first pouring down in there, like before it even touches the pot, I mean it's just uh, just like as if you just holding your cup right underneath the. Uh, the stream as it comes down and this comes right and that's because that's what it does it it's a uh, it uh it's trapped in these little cups and then you use these little i use this little portable uh majo uh presto uh you know one cup coffee maker you know it keeps it uh, have a uh a little it just has a little punch down in there and you just uh put that in there and uh and it stays fresh like that till you get ready till you get your water in it and you have your water in it, you have a cup under it, and after you have your cup under it and your water in it and everything, well then you punch the hole. And then you then you, you you've already got your pressure in here and then you just uh, it's already vacuumed uh, back it vacuum sealed there and then you just press on that and it just pushes the water right down through. And so then you have a nice fresh cup of coffee which never has never enters the air or anything until it goes right into your cup. So there's no aroma or no flavor, or anything escapes. And so I'm gonna get Tanya Love going and uh, begin to enjoy all this, uh, these marvelous things. <laughs> this uh, Organic Gold Company uh, uh, is, a, is a marvelous company and uh, it's, uh, I order all of these things from uh, <laughs> from uh, uh, this uh, company right here uh, uh, on uh, 
this is the website. I just ordered off the website, and then it comes to me a few days later. BMARLLC.OrganicGold.com. And um, they've got all the uh, different flavors printed out on on that once you when you uh, punch that in, when you search for that uh on the internet and then you just uh, pick out the one you want and it comes to you a few days later and it's just as simple it's so simple you know you don't have to go down to the store or anything and get it and so i'm going to uh get all that going get tanya love going 